Dr. Alex George has shared his funeral wishes and told how he wants mourners to remember him with a trip to the beach to remember the good times. During the Let's Start Talking podcast hosted by Loose Women presenter Colleen Nolan, Dr. Alex explained how he has started to think more about death and his funeral wishes. The NHS doctor says that instead of his funeral being a grand affair, the event will be more for the family and friends he leaves behind. The podcast, which is part of our important campaign with co-op funeral care to make people more comfortable when it comes to discussing death and funeral wishes, is now available to download from Apple Podcasts, Spotify or Google Play Store. Speaking on the podcast, Dr. Alex said he would rather have a cremation ceremony in Pembrokeshire and wouldn't mind if people turned up in casual attire to the funeral. He said, I've thought a little bit about it and cremation is definitely what I would choose. And I think probably a slightly traditional funeral ceremony, but I'm not expecting suits and things like that. I think it would be fine for people to turn up in casual clothing, and I would like a few readings such as stories or memories about me to be read out. He added, it'd like the funeral and cremation to be in Pembrokeshire, and then for people to go to Newgale Beach, in Wales, near where I grew up. They could bring their coffee or whiskey in flasks or whatever they'd like, and just remember those good times about me. Colleen also asked Dr. Alex what type of music he'd want to be played at the ceremony, to which he laughed and jokingly replied staying alive. He went on to explain that a mix of somber and more energetic music would be the ideal choice for him. Dr. Alex said, that's a tough question, I'd probably have to build a home by the cinematic orchestra, that's a really powerful song. Then I'd pick something like Nirvana from my teenage years, and after that an Elton John song. So it would be a mixture to make people cry a bit and then the more upbeat stuff too. Dr. Alex thinks that the most important part of a funeral is making sure you're remembered in a positive way. He explained, I think if people remembered me as a good and kind person, that would be great. That's the number one thing. I think you can do what you like in life and you can achieve different things, but none of that really matters, in the end. If people think back to that person and say they were an imperfect person but they were a good person, that would be it. No one's perfect? Dr. Alex also explained how he began thinking more about death and funeral wishes with his family after tragically losing his younger brother to suicide three years ago, who was just 19 years old at the time. He said, grief is a really complex thing and I'm glad we're here talking about death and grief today because most Brits don't discuss it often enough, but it's literally part of all our lives. By not acknowledging death, you're also not really acknowledging the value of life as well, no one is invincible. Dr. Alex has already discussed his mum's funeral plans with her, and believes in the benefits of having similar conversations with our loved ones. He said, my mum has said to me that she wants Stairway to Heaven playing at her funeral, I told her she's so cliché, but it's her favourite song. I think we should talk about death more, to understand it, because when I think about my brother, the circumstances were very unexpected and it was different because it was a very sudden thing. When someone dies, you're in acute grief and shock, you're trying to think, what do I do now? What songs do I pick? You might be sat down for hours trying to choose three songs or whatever. It's so stressful because you feel a sense of guilt then, like am I doing this right? The Let's Start Talking podcast is available to download now from Apple Podcasts, Spotify or Google Play. 
talking now helps your loved ones later. For help starting your conversation visit Coop. Co.uk slash funeral care.